Hello everyone, I am Vijay Gadbe and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will understand how to deal with the missing data. So let us go to the Azure Machine Learning Studio and understand the same. Now open the workspace. To do that, click on Machine Learning. This is the workspace. Now open the Machine Learning Studio. Then go to Designer and open a new pipeline. I'll change the pipeline name Data Cleaning then click on Settings select Compute Type Compute Cluster now select Azure Machine Learning Compute Cluster this one great go to datasets drag dataset 5 to the canvas let us preview the data so there are total 14 columns and 200 observations in this dataset go to profile click on the first column after clicking on a column we are getting the visualizations as well as we are getting the statistical summary. Scroll down in the statistical summary. Here you can see missing count 0. Here we will check for all the columns. For second column missing count 0. Click on credit score. Missing count 11. Now scroll down. Click on this column, Tenure, Missing Count, 9. So in this dataset, I checked all the columns. There are only two columns with the missing values. Tenure with 9 missing values and Credit Score with 11 missing values. So there are only two columns with the missing values in this dataset. Now close this. To deal with these missing values, we have to use a module. Now search here. Clean missing data. With the help of this module, we can deal with the missing data. Now drag it to the canvas. I'll minimize this one. Specify input. Now click on this module. First, we have to select the columns with the missing data. To do that, edit column. I'll select by name, select this column, credit score and tenure. Here we are selecting only these two columns and this is because these two columns has the missing values. And in all these columns, there are no missing values. Now save. After that, we have to specify the minimum missing value ratio and maximum missing value ratio. Here I'll specify 0.04 and here I'll specify 0.15. Let us understand this. Here we specified 0.04 under minimum missing value ratio. Clean only column with missing value ratio above specified value. And this is out of set of all selected columns. In simple words, we are selecting the percentage of missing values. This is the minimum percentage and this is the maximum percentage of missing values in each column. To clean the missing data, this module will consider only those columns which have missing value percentage between 4 and 15. Now scroll down. We have to select the cleaning mode. There are various options for that. Custom substitution value, replace with the mean, replace with the median, replace with the mode remove entire row with the missing value and remove entire column so we will go with this one replace with mean after that we have to specify generate missing value indicator column i'll make it as true and keep this as default so first we selected the columns that we want to deal with the missing values after that we specified minimum missing value ratio and maximum missing value ratio. So here we are selecting only those columns 
which have missing values between 4 and 15 percent. After that we specified the cleaning mode that means we are replacing the missing values with the column mean as well as we are generating missing value indicator column and keep all other things as default. Now click on submit. I'll create new experiment. Clean missing data. I'll keep the job description as it is and submit. Submitting the pipeline. Now this pipeline is running. We can see same. View run overview. Under attributes, we can see the status running. It will take few minutes to run the pipeline. So I'll fast forward the process. So this pipeline run is completed successfully. Now click on this module and preview the data. Under preview, we have two options, clean data set and cleaning transformation. Click on that, clean data set. Now there are total 16 columns in our data set. Previously it was 14. So the two columns are added. Let us see. So this column we have selected. You can see here the missing value replaced with mean. You can see this one. Then for the column tenure, missing values are replaced with the mean. You can see this one. Now go to end. So these two columns are added here. Credit score underscore is missing. Tenure underscore is missing. So these are the boolean values. Second value is replaced with the mean for credit score. Now check here. In second row, boolean value is true. So where there are missing values, it is indicating as true. Here also true. And for this column is also same. True. That means in fourth row, it has missing value. Then here also. Now close this. These two extra columns are added because we have selected true here. Generate a column that indicates which rows were cleaned. To clean the missing data, we have to specify all these details. First, we have to select the columns. Then we have to specify minimum missing value ratio and maximum missing value ratio. After that, we have to specify the cleaning mode. And you can specify this one as well. Generate missing value indicator column. Now we will try with another mode. Now select replace with mode. Now note down one more important point here. We have selected minimum missing value ratio as 0.04 and maximum ratio as 0.15. And the percentage of missing values of these two columns falls into this range. Now click on submit. I'll select the existing experiment, keep the job description as it is and submit. Submitting the pipeline run. Now run preparing. And running the pipeline. I'll fast forward the process here. So this pipeline run is completed successfully. Click on this module. Check the output. This one clean data set. Here you can see the missing value is replaced by mode. This is mode 850 for this column credit score. Then go to tenure and this is the mode value for this column tenure 6. Here you can see true. So the second observation is replaced by the mode and here also you can see the same. The fourth observation is replaced by mode. Now close this.
in the similar way you can try other cleaning modes these replace with median remove entire row and remove entire column so this tutorial about dealing with the missing values ends here i'll see you in the next one till then happy learning